Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Just want to show you a quick update. As I always say that you need to keep exploring. I ordered these ball bearings from Amazon and created a fidgeting toy for myself. The best part about this thing is it's it's very easy to you know build these kind of stuff at your home. And these are the kind of things if you continue doing, it will give you lots of ideas about designing new stuff. And why this is important is because if you don't play around with tools and if you don't try to build things with your own hands, you will not be able to prepare for studio test and material handling exercises at the last moment. So keep playing with different types of materials. If anything is available in the market which you can easily buy and play around with, or if there is something already available at your home for disposal, anything which you are going to throw away like these old you know shampoo bottles, oil bottles, you can you know make something like this as a pan stand and you know keep exploring stuff. Like this, I made a small cut and I can you know hang this stuff. So it's gonna be something like this. You can easily hang on some ball or something. So stuff like this, if you keep exploring, you know it's it's a very fun way during your preparation to you know to change your mood, you know get into relaxation. So if you keep exploring things in such a way with basic tools like cutter, plier, some glue gun, or you know stuff like that, it is very easy to prepare yourself for studio test and. Uh, you know, sometimes you will end up making something very good for your portfolio and this is a great way to relax guys like sometimes I come back from office early and you know I'll fidget it around I'll play around with some stuff and try to build something sometimes it, it comes out very nice sometimes I fail I am not able to build something which I expected and it happens like you know this particular toy uh, is breaking multiple times because of this uh, poor joinery but it's fine like uh, I would be making some kind of you know plastic structure around it or I'll be making some wooden fixture around it or I'll do a proper mold sometime on weekend but I'll try to make you know a toy for myself this is the kind of uh, spirit of exploration you need in your preparation because ultimately it's not just about cracking an exam like an ID or NAV or C. It's ultimately for you to become a designer. And this is the approach that you should have on a daily basis. If you want to see yourself as a designer practicing in the industry and earning your bread and butter from this work. So guys, explore that creative side of yours in material, in building something with your own hands and learn things which you cannot learn otherwise i hope you like this video if you build something please share and enjoy the process till then bye bye take care see you in the next video